What's up, YouTube? And what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to another Pokemon TCG opening video. Today, we're going to be opening up the new Team Skull pin collection. Now, when I was at Walmart last week and I was like looking for some Shining Legend stuff, I saw this box and I was like, the heck is that? I had never seen it. Uh, so it was a total surprise to me, and I purchased it and I was planning on opening it today for this video, but I hadn't heard anybody talk about it. So I was like, did I like find a secret stash of them? And then of course, all of the usual people like Stealthless and Poke Sisters had their pin collections out and it was like, well, okay. Uh, but anyway, um, this box is huge. That's why it's not sitting up. Cause if it was, it would like completely block this the, the face cam. Um, so let's jump straight to the pack cam where you can see this gigantic box and I don't even know what's in this <clears throat> to be honest uh, I've kind of looked at it a little bit but not really this box is is amazing though so I'm gonna try and preserve it as best I can I think I might hold on to it because this is a really cool looking box but I guess there is a back that we can read here we go and that shouldn't be blocking anything so it says <clears throat> team skull brings the beat down Nasty crew of Team Skull brings poisonous heat with Salazzle GX and double trouble cross cuts with Galissapod GX. You get both as never seen before foil, uh, foil promo cards, plus two foil cards pre featuring Salandit and Wimpod, and an awesome Team Skull pin. You ready for street battles with some sick battles, yo? <clears throat> some sick beatdowns, yo? Time to go all out, Team Skull style. And there's a lot of stuff. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not reading all that. I want to be surprised when I open this. That's it? Oh, it's in here. I don't even remember how much I spent on this. I don't have a clue. Great, it won't come out. Oh, I see why. There we go. Alright, so first thing I noticed... <clears throat> look at that. That's inside the box. The little, it's a little skull, the little, what you gonna call it? <clears throat> That's so cool. This box is amazing. And then we just have five packs and the promo cards. Okay, sure. I don't, I don't think I understand the point of this, but it's cool. Also, you might notice that the lighting is different. Um, I'm recording this much later than I typically do. <clears throat> Let me know what you think about this lighting. This lighting actually kind of dig it. I kind of dig it. <clears throat> Got a Team Skull pin that we'll put back there. Um, so yeah, in our Burning, or excuse me, our uh, Shining Legends video that we did last week, we only opened uh, an Elite Trainer box. That's all we've done so far. There will be more. There will be another one coming out tomorrow as another special Sunday video. Uh, <clears throat> But I don't want to really spoil too much about what I got. Um, you know, I, I might have gotten something good, maybe. I really don't remember. Um, unless you're the observant kind. Uh, but let's take a look at these promo cards. So this isn't even a promo card. This is just a hollow version of the common from Guardians Rising. And then, of course, we have the promo Salazzle GX. And then we have Wimpod, hollow. And then a hollow Galissapod GX. So Galissapod might wind up being a deck that I use, depending on how many of those I have. I might need to get into that. But then what do we have here? We have five packs. We have Breakthrough, <clears throat> Breakpoint, Burning Shadows, Evolutions, and Burning Shadows. Why did they make this? And why did they include these particular packs in them? I don't know the answer to that. If you know the answer to that, will you please tell me? Also, per usual, if you got this box, go ahead and let me know what you pulled and we'll compare our pulls with each other. Wait. Okay, I'm fine with that. <clears throat> so first up is Breakpoint. Now, knowing my luck, <clears throat> excuse me, Breakpoint is gonna wind up being the one, Breakpoint or Breakthrough or uh, Evolutions is, wind up, is gonna wind up being the pack that we get a pull in. So. I'll be happy with whatever we pull, if we pull something. Hopefully it's not this one, because that's a nice quality card. 
But anyway, let's go through this. I have not opened Breakpoint or Breakthrough in a while. Uh, I still need to open up a Breakthrough box. Uh, just for me, just for collector's sake. But there's nothing in there, which I'm okay with. Next up, we have our Burning Shadows, which is the one that we're hopeful for. I still haven't pulled... I haven't pulled anything above a GX in a couple months, honestly. I've pulled a lot of GXs, but not anything better than that. And I'm doing this recording right after watching a video where someone pulled a bunch of really good stuff. And I'm hoping that I can bring some of that luck over. But let's go with a Psychic Energy. That was the other one I was thinking about calling. And when it starts with a Sneasel, you know it's bad news. That might be my mascot, but for some reason, he just does not like me. I, I don't know why. That's a lot of grass cards in a, in a row. The Viper and an Araquan Mid. Next up is our Evolutions Pack. <clears throat> All right. If there's anything in here, it could be the it could be a Charizard. As long as it's a Charizard, I'm okay with that. But our Sun and Moon sets have not given us anything nice in a long, long, long time. We pulled a Sycamore for our Sycamore a few weeks ago in the. Uh, uh, what's that called? Steam Siege, which was cool, uh, but I don't know why the Sun and Moon sets hate us so much. That's technically a secret rare, right? Surfing Pikachu, Misty's Determination, Reverse, Hollow Rare Arcanine, followed by a Slowbro EX, which... Eh. 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 We pulled something, so I guess that's cool. Next up is Breakthrough. It's always got to be slow, bro. It's always got to be slow, bro. Last time it was mega slow, bro. There are people, oh my gosh. Hey, hold on to your dog. Just watch her chase her dog across the parking lot. Anyway. Uh, this is what? This is break something something? Break point? Break through? No, this is break through, right? <clears throat> These are cards I've never seen, so it must be break through. I've probably seen them, but not enough to like register them to memory. Giovanni Scheme and a Simi Sage. Okay, we really need this last Burning Shadows to be something good. Because however much I spent for a slow bro, don't know if I would be satisfied with that. Can the Sun and Moon sets come through for once? Give us something higher than a GX. I'm going to go for a water energy for our slow bro. Fire. That could actually... Does that tell me what's coming? I would love if it was. Uh, Burning Shadows is here. Another Sneasel. That's never a good sign. But Ralts is a good sign. I would love to pull something that uses Ralts or Kiawe. Grimer. And a Marshadow GX. All right. Two GX cards in this Team Skull Blister. Or Team Skull Pin Collection. So out of five packs, we pulled Slowbro EX and Marshadow GX. It's not too bad, I suppose. Um, but again, if you open this box, please let me know what you pulled in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button. Do subscribe if you're new. Like I said, um, tomorrow we're going to be opening up... Uh, tomorrow, I think we're going to be opening up this bad boy right here. Uh, this Mewtwo Shining Le Shinings Legend, Shining Legends uh pin collection i think we're going to be opening this up tomorrow and then the following tuesday we have a special video where we're going to be opening up this we're going to be competing in a um kind of like the battle royale that we did or battle rumble whatever it was called that we did um last month with burning shadows but that'll be it for today we will see you tomorrow for our second shining legends opening until then have a blessed day